You're going to arrest me? You're going to throw me out of here? Screaming doesn't make you You want to arrest me and throw me out of here? It's my call. I'm in this store and I paid for it. Uh, I am not going to. I've done nothing wrong. I've done nothing wrong. I've done nothing wrong. You and three chips. I'm playing my hand. A contestant in the World Series of Poker is going to lose it at the table. I have to make threats. I mean, security is being called on me. I haven't done anything wrong. I got nine people berating me. I'm not allowed to stick up for myself. I've done nothing wrong. Uh, sir, I, I, I won't know I should word again. I have done nothing wrong. And I'll sue this place. I will sue you for discrimination. That is what's happening. It is not my behavior. It is their behavior, and it's not being properly policed. This guy's cursing. These people have been cursing. They all have been making fun of me and berating me. They've all been harassing me. I haven't done anything wrong. I've done nothing wrong. I play by the rules. I don't do anything wrong. She would continue screaming and further berate security, which did not help her cause. That's insane. That's insane. All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Have a great time. I'm thrown out of this tournament, and I did nothing wrong. Nothing. This whole table was ganging up on me. I spent $8,000 in this table. You better hold back to me. You got nine people are harassing me. Why don't you say anything to them? Why is this acceptable? In the hallway. Another person would try having a conversation with her to no avail. She'd soon depart, but not before getting her money's worth in the form of screaming, of course, not actually winning. Lots of takeaways, of course. But first, if you can, please do subscribe to Chainsaw Slots on YouTube. Firstly, they provided the video. And secondly, after exploring their channel, if you're into poker, then this is is the channel for you. Secondly, I know that a lot of people, when they lose, they take out their frustrations on the dealer, but I can't imagine being that person and having to experience this. And I'm sure that they have stories aplenty about what has gone down at their tables and the outbursts that people have had when they have gotten frustrated. We've all been there and seen it, right? If you are a degenerate or a novice, and you've been at those tables, you have seen this in some form. Third, her saying that she was going to sue for discrimination in the opening part of this video, we don't know what happened prior to this, but if that is the card that one would play in an instance like this when no one is saying a word, and she is going off in the fashion that she is, I have to think that she is completely losing not only the argument, but the entire scene and buildup of events to get to our climax. And then, of course, she was let out. Um, fourth, and we didn't see this um, in the original piece for time purposes, but everyone clapped when she left, which shows me a lot. It shows that this was going on for some time. The fact that they gave her in this video about three minutes and 20 seconds, three minutes and 30 seconds says a lot. And even if it is the World Series of Poker and she paid to be there and she wanted to be there, the fact that every single person at the table was dead quiet and just allowed her to continue digging her own hole speaks volumes. So maybe this is for those out there, a case in point example of what not to do. You can pay as much as you want to pay. It does not give you a sense of entitlement to behave in the fashion that she did and then cry foul that you gave money to be in that seat. It's just astonishing.